Hi, I'm Scott Stevens, and today I wanted to show you how to change the drive belts on our lower tone tumblers. All right, we're going to start with the uh, Model 3A. This is the single barrel model. We'll take the barrel off here, but before we do anything, we always want to make sure that our machine is unplugged, because what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to take four screws out to un to take off the uh, blue cover. So let me get my screwdriver out here. We've got two screws on the side that we're going to want to tackle. Oops, there we do one there and one here. I'm going to turn it around so I can access the other screws because we've got one on the outside here and then one right on the inside. A little bit larger screw. And with these four screws out of the way, we can take off our cover and access that broken drive belt and start to replace it. Okay, now we're going to put on our new drive belt. Got a new one here. And basically what we're going to do is we're going to loop the belt first around this drive fan onto the pulley here. Then we're going to loop the other end around this larger pulley. It won't be very tight, so you should be able to do it, slide it on very easily with your fingers. And there we go. We're ready to put our cover on, screw it back together, and plug it in, and we'll be ready to go. Accessing the drive belts on the 33B and the 45C tumblers is a little bit easier, so let's find out how to do that. All right, with the 45C and the 33B model, we'll do basically the same thing. Remove our barrel, get that out of the way, again, making sure it's unplugged. But instead of taking the entire cover off, we just have to access this silver cover right here by removing one screw. Removing the cover. Oh, there's our drive belt. Let's get rid of that and we'll put a new one on. Okay, with these models we've got a little bit larger drive belt. But no problem. We're going to do it exactly the same way as we did the other model. We've got our drive fan here with a small pulley on it and the larger pulley so I'm going to feed this so that part of it goes right in between the two and I'm going to loop the belt right onto that smaller pulley and then loop the rest of it over the larger pulley. Now it's a little bit tight fit in here so I'm going to take something like a pen here something that's not sharp and use it to push the drive belt onto the larger pulley as I turn it and there we go. It's right on. Put our silver cover back on, plug it in, and we'll be ready to go too. With spare parts from us, you can keep your Lortone tumblers running for years to come. This is Scott from FDJTool.com. Hey, are you rolling? <laughs> All right. <laughs>